Okay, I'm back. Did the weekly seed. So now, I think what I'm gonna do is just something fun. Just gonna do a fun, just like a mystery. Uh, and that'll be it. Hopefully, uh, I'll actually be streaming tomorrow. We'll see. Tomorrow is when Hurricane Ida is supposed to be far enough inland here in Mississippi. I live in central Mississippi that uh, it may fuck some shit up for us. I don't know if we'll lose power. I don't know if we do lose power, how long we're gonna lose it. So this may be my, honestly my last stream for like a week. We'll have to wait and see. Hopefully everything will be alright. Uh, of course, we're not getting it nearly as bad as people on the coast. Uh, people are panicking, rightly so, because it's a Category 4 or something like that. And it, this is 16 years ago this weekend is the anniversary of when Katrina hit. And uh, so everybody is very wary. Uh, and I think that's a smart thing to be. So uh, hopefully everybody is staying safe down south uh, and in the Gulf. So we are going to roll a, a mystery seed and where do I do this this is where I do this so we're gonna move this stuff to here let me rename this okay Welcome, welcome. We're just going to do a mystery seed. Open world. We are going to hit no music. Or the regular music. Uh, presets. We're just going to do a just a straight up mystery seed. Uh, blind mystery. Would you like to obscure the settings? Yes. So we're going to generate that seed. We have no clue what the settings are. The game is just going to... The system is just going to populate a seed. And we're going to jump into it. So let's do it clear this as well clear my notes from last game all right mystery seed let's let's do it this will be fun we're gonna start with the sprite here we go mystery seed it's gonna be fun three two one go <laughs> Open world, so we don't know what any of the things are, any of the settings, anything like that. What our goal is, we have to figure the, all that out on the fly. There is! You're right, Elliot, and we're so glad that it's a thing, because it allows people uh, near infinite replayability with their favorite games. Oh! Steps! They're hard. <laughs> I've, I, I start with the whip all the time. Wait, I pulled the boy out? What? <laughs> Wait, what just happened? What to, oh, it start with the boy. Oh, it start with multiple characters. I don't know if I've ever run a seed like this. So we start... In, oh, no, wait, we're starting with... Hold on, wait. I don't know if I've ever seen like this before. So we may not have... Interesting, interesting, interesting. Okay, cool. So we're starting with two characters. We have the glove and the whip. I've, I've never run one like this before. Usually you have to find the other characters. Uh, this So we may not even have the girl. The girl may not exist. Okay, the, the Mana Fortress does exist, so we know that it is either long vanilla or short vanilla. <laughs> that was wild. I was not expecting that. Early game for the girl. Okay, so the girl exists. Wow. <laughs> awesome. I love it. That'd be great if the girl was right there. <laughs> Get out of the way! <laughs> oh my gosh. Wild shit. I love it. Okay, first off, let me do this real quick. So we're at 16 and 0. We're about to glean some information here from this, this, this chair. So 16, so that's triple... Triple experience, triple gold. Alright. <laughs> Don't need Sylphid. We may not need this at all. Don't need Sylphid. And we also don't know, like, how things are leveling up. So we're going to figure that out as well. We only need three elements. Wow. Oh, you're getting killed.
Okay, we've leveled up. So now we gotta see if the enemies have also leveled up. Okay, so it's level up on boss kill. Okay. Okay, so level up on boss kill. Triple gold, triple experience. Midge and mid game. Okay. Oh, well, I was I was on the screen that I wanted to be on. Wow, we've got some information. <laughs> this is pretty great. Okay. So triple experience, triple gold. Enemies level up on boss kill. And with this being a normal um, mystery seed, there's. This is either going to be slightly easy, normal, or slightly hard, which means everything should only level up two levels. I think things start leveling up at three levels per boss kill once you get to the um, hard mode. So we shouldn't have to worry about that. The Wind Seed. All right. Where did my mouse go? Disappeared. And the Gold Key. <laughs> right out the gate. Okay, cool. Neat. Thanks. See if we can find some uh, some magic for the sprite early on. That'd be nice. An axe orb. Okay. Can I just go out? Look, that's not a door. <laughs> that's the that's the outside door that I wanted to go to. I'm going to go ahead and pick up this first chest here because it's on the way to Southtown. Just run in, grab the chest, run back out. I'll come back for the bosses. We also, so the last thing we need to figure out is, uh, is this restrictive logic? Good to find one of those since we actually have that weapon. Fuck you, Mara. <laughs> you betch. How dare you? Maybe Christy will have something. She likes me. I don't know. <laughs> Late game, Moogle. Alright. Excuse me, sir. I'm on an adventure. Hit him! <laughs> Do something. Nice. Javelin orb and the sword. Do pop. The sword any good? Definitely seems that way.
I don't think these guys have hints that they haven't been programmed. How bad is this room? <laughs> this room is always the worst room to just like stumble into from the stairs. Okay, that's enough. Because I've deemed it so. Alright, let's go to the ruins and get those chests. So because it's a level up on boss kill, I'm hesitant to just like go ahead and dive things um, too soon. Since I'm going to start putting stuff at level 3 and level 5. Though I should be fine even like naked and armed with uh, a toy sword. I should be good to uh, to take on a couple of bosses. So I may clear, I may go ahead and do like Ice Palace in its fullness, like in its totality. Because um, that way I don't have to fucking deal with that again. It's a, it's a kind of a long check and those two bosses are back to back. So it's like, let's just get it out of the way, right? No fear. <laughs> Blow that bird right the fuck up. <gasps> Who cares? Oh boy, couple wishes. Let's go ahead and dive this one. Why not? <laughs> Killed that bird trying to poop. She hated when uh, a small mystical child runs in and uh, destroys you with a whip while you're just trying to get to the bathroom. <laughs> Barely out of range. <laughs> Door number one. Door number two. Now, of course, the ultimate joke would be if we uh, find, like, do all this leveling up and then we find the girl at level one instead of current level. I don't know. <laughs> Quit attacking the incorporeal beings and slap this duck. This is a long check. Was it worth it? No. <laughs> Absolutely not. Okay, axe in a chest. 
In fact, it's this chest right here. No. <laughs> Damn. Um, okay. Yeah, I may just go ahead and clear Ice Palace just to have it done. So stuff's gonna be higher level. I mean, we're, we're attacking with level one weapons. Ah, but we don't have any magic. Uh, I'm actually... Pr Until we find some magic, I'm actually kind of hesitant to do that. Even though we are, like, level six right now. I just don't know. I just don't know how to, how to handle this as far as speed is concerned. But that would go ahead and level things up so, like, going around getting these kills would actually mean something. A glove orb. Yeah, let's go ahead and do it. This may be a dumb play. But we're, we're leveling up pretty well. I think getting everybody up another few levels will also help out with the gold situation. And therefore, being able to afford, like, weapon levels and stuff like that a little faster. Eh. Got stuck on that... That china cabinet or whatever. We're doing no damage right now to this dude. So that should be all of his magic. He should only have enough for three casts. Which means we're doing pretty good damage if he's shook enough to have cast them all back to back like that. Here we go. Okay. Nice. <laughs> How utterly convenient. Yeah, okay, so whip may be the weapon of choice this time around. So these guys should be level three. Level two. Oh my gosh, we're on slightly easy. Okay, alright, well. <laughs> I think that's what it is, is if they, they only go up one level from a boss kill, then we're on slightly easy mode. So, all right, well, <laughs> triple gold, triple experience, slightly easy mode. Let's just uh, run around killing a bunch of gods. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> this will just, I've been gifted a walk in the park. <laughs> Okay, so honestly, I may go ahead and do the one in uh, the warm town. Just to have this continent done. If things, if this is slightly easy mode and things are only leveling up one level per boss kill, 
then, uh, yeah. Look at all these seeds, and we have no mana to cast. We have no magic. We can go ahead and level up the whip and glove at least once each. Let's go. Let's go see what we can do here first. What kind of money we are looking at before we buy anything over there? Let's see if we can afford leveling up weapons. Oh yeah. So what does that give us? Thunder damage, and, okay. Actually, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll leave it like that. I do have, um, I mean, that is a cutting weapon now, so I do have access to, like, LNA's castle right now. <laughs> and all of the Imperial lands. Um, I can't buy anything from you. All right, let's go ahead and fight the uh, Boreal kids. Boop, up, boop, up, up. So these guys should be level. Yep, we're on slightly easy mode. Oh boy. Wait, does this do stone damage? Hold on, wait. Oh, uh, it does. Oh, wait. Son of a bitch. Give me this. This does thunder damage, though, so that's nice. That was pleasant. I'm glad we don't have to deal with him at a higher level. <laughs> we had thunder gloves, thank God. <laughs> Alright, so this whole continent is cleared, which is nice. Pff, fuck off. <laughs> Unbelievable. Okay, back to our normal checks. <laughs> we And so we got some good information there. So we are on slightly easy mode. Triple gold, triple experience. Still don't know if it's vanilla long or vanilla short. I'm all about that. Thank you kindly. Got him. Light seed at a mana seed. Okay.
Okay. Um, I guess let's do these mandala hints. Let's get them. Don't need Undine. Need Lumina, which means we need the girl. <laughs> okay. Okay, North Town for Water Seed, we're gonna go ahead and. Oh, we already have that. Okay, so, and then. What was it? It was Fire Palace Final thing? I didn't write this down. This Fire Palace Final is Dryad. Okay. Eh. Eh. Those are some eh hints. Those are some eh. I'm actually going to duck in here and buy some stuff. Oh. No, that's the wrong one. I was like, maybe it's a spiky suit. It, it is not. <laughs> All right. Okay, so, those are those hints. We're going to land at the uh, flower field and get the two hints there. And then go clear, um... Guys, enable as best we can. 200 gold? Hell yeah. I'm excited. Oh my god, I don't care. Empire has dryad magic. More gold. Okay. We got checks to do here. We got four freebies. We can also glimpse what we need for Earth Temple. And... Uh, bosses? A boomerang orb. Oops, that's wrong. Uh, I like the whip orb because I actually have a whip. <laughs> Thank you so much. Go ahead and clear this out as well. Let's see what we got. Oop. That ain't great. <laughs> punch, punch Dracula. Punch him in his face. He's too high up. <laughs> there we go. You know what? G give me the... Oh, I can't trade because you're currently taking damage. Man, I would love to... For him to stop chaining spells together so I can steal the whip from the boy. 
Give me that shit. Thank you. Oh my god! <laughs> Good, you have nothing. Just fucking stop. Just stop snapping your fingers so I can actually hit you. God, how does he move so fast? Stop it. This dude is wild. Thank you. <laughs> Ugh. What an annoying fight. <laughs> Gosh, give me magic. Give me magic or give me death. Actually, just give me magic. I didn't mean that. Gnome. Meh. Um, I'm gonna do this, uh... Check here. And then come back and maybe we'll buy some armor if we can afford it. If they have affordable armor. Hey! That helps. Okay. And those guys got got. Excuse me, sir. Great. Oop. Okay, let's check the armor. Also... Let's go ahead and level up the sword once and see if that'll give us something good. Cool, some thunder damage. Now we can move that back to you. Okay, let's check the shop, fight Tropicalo, move on with our lives. That'll clear everything here until we find Gnome. We have found zero magic so far. We found four seeds. Yay, we can actually wear these. Okay. And then... I didn't actually see if there was a hat that the uh, sprite could wear, but oh well. They'll be fine.
Oh boy. <laughs> okay. Let's go to Pandora now. Clear that. So what is that? One, two, three, four, five bosses? Have there been any others? I think that's it. So everything should be level seven right now. <laughs> oh my gosh! And the sea hair tail. Okay, finally something. Some some I've gotten so many nothing checks. Uh I'll hold off on that. I'm gonna go to Pandora first. But it could be anything. It could even be no magic. Actually, I have no clue. And then after this, I think we'll do um, LNA's castle. And also, I need a glimpse whether this is a... Actually, after this, because when you leave the Mana Fortress... It spits you out over the sunken continent in the southeastern corner of the world. Uh, since I'm nearby already, I might as well um, go up and check and see if it's um, fucking bully me. So whether this is a uh, vanilla long or vanilla short. Should I check these chests? Like, candy? I like it. Need it. Like, part of me is like, oh, you should be opening all the chests. Who knows what it could be in there? But as of right now, like, the most it's going to give me is like 300 gold or something like that. 350 gold. But it could also just like. Poison me or something. Ba 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 ba. Hit him. <laughs> Good. Okay, this is going to open up a lot of checks for us, which is nice. And then after this, land at the uh, Mana Fortress, see what that is, and then turn in the Sea Hair's Tail, and then I guess maybe LNA's Castle. Fucking what? Now would be a good time to charge up again. I'm glad I'm doing this check early. I wish I had done it a little earlier, but this isn't too bad. Quit running away! Ugh. It's like... <laughs> where is the magic? That's what I want to know. Start with the sprite. Start with zero magic. Keep dealing damage. Just keep slapping away at him. Okay. So that's good. 
Because that'll open up all of the Pandora chests. God damn, these nothing checks. <laughs> There's so many of them so far. <laughs> okay. Alright, so. Let's see. I, I actually haven't checked the uh, initial shop. This isn't where I want to be. Um, so I don't know what kind of armor situation. We need a hat for the for the sprite. Could get that. Uh, let's see. Can I afford this? No, not yet. We're loaded. Okay, we're good. Cool. <laughs> Pokemon lady, not there. Absent. We will never know. She's usually right there before uh, you get to the guard. Is this uh, woman in green hair? And you, during races, I don't talk to her because, like, I mean, it, it wastes all of like five seconds for the box to pop up. But it's like the Pokemon of the day, five hundred gold. Oh boy! It's just some little hidden funny thing that Mobile didn't put in here. Do you have a hint for me? No. Nine hundred gold. Oop. Spear orb. <laughs> oh my gosh, so much money. Bow orb. The axe. Okay, good. And Luna Magic. Oh, nice. Okay. <laughs> it sucks that we have Luna Magic and then have nothing else that we can gas. So we can get Luna up to four. We can we're really good at stealing people's magic. <laughs> okay, let's check and see what the uh whether this is a vanilla long or vanilla short. It is a vanilla short. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. So let's get good enough. Let's go ahead and grab this, um, some information here about the orbs, too. Let's find out what Fire Palace first orb is and Moon Palace orb is. If either of them are Luna, I can do it now. How slow would that be? So that also means that we don't need to clear the, um, shade, okay. We also don't need to clear the, uh, whoa, what am I doing? Uh, Mana Palace. The, um, Grand Palace. But we can, since we have the whip, go ahead and get that check. So I think after this, what I'm going to do is pick up... Let's see what this is. I'm going to pick up the... Oh, what am I doing? I need to go this way, right? Yeah. Undine, we're out of here. We are going to go to the Grand Palace. And get the one chest there that we can get. There's also the underground area where we can get to a chest with the um with the axe. 
clear up these freebies. I may do this first boss, too. Hmm, yeah, we'll do this first boss. Oh, it's wrong. I, I clicked the wrong thing. Whatever. I don't have either weapon right now, so it doesn't matter. Fucked it. Fucked it up. I was in a rush. I was like, let me just get this fucking thing. There we go. <laughs> Oh, I'm stuck in the <laughs> the bushes. What kind of damage am I dealing? Do I have anything that does thunder damage? Earth damage. Give me that. The dodge. Uh-oh. I should have canceled that. Oh well. <laughs> that was dumb. I just let him do that to me. I think I can just switch weapons and switch back and it'll get rid of it though. Yeah. There we go. Okay. This is the only boss we're doing here. Wow. <laughs> Thanks, bro. Double double bow orb. Love it. Okay. It's just like, yeah, it's right here. Okay. Fuck you. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> Alright, so we can do this check up here, and then we're getting out of here. Got him.
No, thank you. <laughs> Goblins are scary. Another seed. <laughs> Whoopty shit. Okay. Okay, so that's everything here. Where to now? LNA's castle. That's where we're going next. Because it's one boss fight, but it gets us um, three checks. I uh, overshot. I'm lost. We have the water seed, so that's another thing is right here, like, um, we don't know if it's restrictive logic or not yet, so, but we have a water seed, so either, either way, this, that's a good place to go to next. Come on. So I just need to either find shade magic or get the girl and get dryad magic. But some more sword orbs would be nice. <laughs> and then I guess if we find, depending on which order we find stuff in, I may want to, with Luna magic, it's nice because I can go ahead and uh, get crit damage. We said the girl's in an early game area. This is an early game area, so that's good. Anything pre-trip um, to the upper land is early game. So it could be in Potos. Could be at Undine's Cave, Water Palace. So we just need something like that. Excuse me. <laughs> All right. We're level 14. I think everything is like level 8 right now. <laughs> we also will need to upgrade... Oh, we don't have a sword orb. We could upgrade the whip. We could upgrade the axe. I don't feel like upgrading the glove. Oh, wait! Spank. Spank in the nether realm. All right. Honestly, haven't seen like the like beginning of game Mantis Ant in quite some time going through this... Oh, you bitch! <laughs> okay, cool. Alright, let's see. Uh, don't have the light seed yet. Axe in a chest. Solved that conundrum. We don't have the midge mallet or the moogle belt. We haven't found girl dryads in the empire. So we know where the Dryad is. Girl is early game, so we have an idea of how to at least get um, the mana, mana sword, and we have critting. So that may be all we need is just get the girl, get Dryad. Gold and a Spear Orb. Eh. However, I would like some more. If we're going to go that route with Dryad and Moon Magic, like critting and everything like that, I would like to find at least at least one more Sword Orb. <laughs> if not more. We have no, no mana right now. No magic. Nothing really offensive that we can deal with. Man, having the girl and no magic is like cheat codes for getting through this game quickly. 
not having to wait on charges, being able to auto run everywhere. It's so nice. Oh, that flashing. Sorry about the flashing, everybody. Yeah, can I just... Yeah, just more crits. <laughs> okay, so we're going to get this prize no matter what. We still don't know if it's restrictive logic or not, but it doesn't matter right here. We're going to get... We have the water seed, so we're going to get everything regardless. Doodly 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 doodly. Way to go. So many axe orbs. Ugh. <laughs> I long for a sword orb. A javelin orb and another fucking axe orb. Shut up! Don't want it. Okay, so there's that. So we have Potos. We have Undine Cave. And then the only other place that I can think of that's early game area would be Earth Temple, which is blocked by Getting Gnome. <laughs> so... Three! Nice. Give me the girl. And not more axe orbs. Oop. Caves are hard. Door doorways difficult. Well, uh, we can go back to the fire palace now. <laughs> Vanilla undine magic. Nice. Um, okay. We've cleared early game except for Underground Palace. <laughs> so the girl is has got to be there. Which means the girl is blocked by having um Gnome. <laughs> which is just the best. Okay, we can come here and at least do the first room and get this first chest. doing nothing nothing smart Super duper. What have we got? Undine, thank God. All right, we are supposed to be here. It's good to feel needed. A sword orb, I'm all about it. All right. So what is our, our final prize here. What was that? It was a bow orb? Um. 
<laughs> wrong. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Y'all stop! <laughs> this is such a long, long last check to make. Or did I not get the hint this time what it was? What the uh, Fire Palace prize was? Oh, we're out of here. <laughs> okay. Um. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Where to now? Cleared everything out here. Uh, I guess we can go to Dark Palace. Since we have the axe and the whip. And we have the dark seed. So once again, still don't know if it's restricted logic, but we can do everything here. It's probably close to time for us to uh, level stuff up. Oh wait, I can walk up here. Let me walk up here and get this uh, leveled up with watts. And also I can check this town real quick just to see. If there's anything here that I can actually purchase. <laughs> oh my gosh, we have so much money. <laughs> ah! What do we got? We got the sword sword. Stone and earth damage. Strength. Humanoid damage, Dryad damage, Thunder damage. We got a pretty good spread. Pretty good spread of damages. I can take my pick. Alright, with my remaining 10,000 gold, can I get something here, please? Oh, so close! Uh, okay, we'll come back for that. This is a great, this is a great little spot, though. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So one thing that I do want to do going through this palace is um Yeah, every yeah, the everything. <laughs> it, th those did not really take off in the market. The uh the $11,000 tree stores. <laughs> Yeah, it's a it's a nice hat. Unfortunately, the boy can't wear them, and he feels a little uh, left out about that. God, everything here casts wall, and I was just coming here to be like, oh, let me level up Undine, real quick. But everything casts wall. That guy doesn't. That guy's fucked. Oh, and a fairy walnut. Nice. Is the javelin? All right. Okay. Oops, wrong button. I need to find another bomb bee that I can suck the soul out of. Do these guys have magic? I think they do. 
Yeah, they they have Undine magic. I'm gonna need this. Okay, we're full upon magic. We have level two Undine. Feeling good, looking good. And a spear orb. Me, me. I don't want it. Pardon me. Thank you. <sighs> Man, I really hope we uh, find some more magic soon. I need to find... So I think I need to get... Oh, I, I haven't fought Mantis Ant. I need to go fight Mantis Ant. That could be the girl right now. Um, but I, otherwise, I will need Gnome. to get the girl. Beat him up! There we go. Alright, this is cleared. And I'm gonna get everything here. Okay. <clears throat> I know Dryad's an Empire. I may just go to the Empire after the- well, Potos and then the Empire. Unless I get Gnome, in which case I'm gonna do both checks. Nice. What else? Okay. I'm fine with another sword orb. Uh, right. So. Mantis Ant, hopefully this will have the girl. I also need to check and see what everybody's level is, and it's probably time for me to find some better armor too. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. Another sword orb. I like it. Here we go. Okay. We gotta get. Oh, and you're level one. Ugh. Well, you're gonna you're gonna get leveled up very quickly. What is the other weapon? What did you show up with? You show up with the boomerang. Okay. Um, you are going to use the axe, and we're gonna check here real quick to see if uh, there's anything worthwhile buying. What do we have right now? What is our equipment? Steel cap and that spiky suit. Not great. Yeah, we need to level up. Fuck it. <laughs> hey, we rescued you. Put on the skimpy outfit. You, you owe it to me. Uh. 
I give you gifts. Show Bob and Vagine. Uh, bu 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 bu. We are going to go to the Empire. Level up the sword. And the Empire should have Dryad here. And then we will level the shit out of um All right. Oh wait. <laughs> we will level the shit out of uh our spells that we actually have and then go to the game. Go to the end of the game. I think that'll be good. What do we got going on here today? Strength, thunder damage. Awesome. I'm cool with keeping all this bonus strength. Hell yeah. Okay. So now we need to get... Eh, she has armor. Uh... Let's, let's get her leveled up. Let's fight through some stuff. <laughs> okay, so what do we think? This first enemy we would kill, how many levels will she gain? The answer is two. <laughs> Three. A lot. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Triple experience is hilarious. Oh well. <laughs> Beat the shit out of that dude. Okay, so we're looking for Dryad magic, and then I think we're gonna be good. Nice. Actually, I would like to find... Okay, Midge, Mallet in mid-game, Moogle in late-game. It'd be good to find one of those. There's the Earth Seed. So I may want to hunt one of those down. Although, that being said, like as long as I have Undine Magic um, and a full supply of... Um, Fairy Walnuts. I should be able to damage cancel with uh, Remedy pretty easily. So I may not have to worry about getting either one of those. Just to make sure I have enough money. We're hoping to get Dryad Magic here.
Here we go. Damn it! <laughs> All right. Uh, let's go to the shop. And then um, we're going to go to the ruins. Because we know that Dryad is in Empire. That is the clue that we got, and we're going to trust it that nothing's fucked up in the code. <laughs> Um, let's see. You need something. We can all get better hats. Eh! We'll come back for that. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Probably faster to fly out of here and land at the ruins rather than go up and around. I don't know, it's probably about the same. <laughs> So this should be our, our last two checks for these two bosses. We're looking for war. Dryad magic. Gosh, <laughs> let me through! <laughs> Sleepy slimes. Go to sleep. See ya! <laughs> These guys are ceased existing pretty quickly.
Alright. <sighs> if this isn't it, it's gotta be the next boss. It's gotta be. <laughs> and then we go uh, level up a bunch of stuff real quick and then go to the end. We've got pretty good. I think we have pretty good defense right now. Fucking hell, Everett, so much, so many nothings, so many. Yeah, I, I know that. <laughs> I, in fact, know exactly which one it is. It's at the fire pedestal. Fucking hell. No, that was... <laughs> Alright. Please give me dryad magic. That's what I want. That's what I want. That is, in fact, what I always wanted. You knew. Okay, so our sword should be fully leveled. Um, let's go back to where? Where can we go? Uh, let's go. Let's loop the earth real quick. And I'm going to go ahead and level up Luna and... Actually, you know, fuck it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go to... Potos, because I have so much money, like, who cares? I do need to make sure, I do need to make sure that I have plenty of, um... Uh, fairy walnuts before I go in. I'm gonna try and get dry it up to level two. There it is. Get this up pretty high as well. I think level two will be plenty for this as well. There we go. Okay, so now let's go level up the girls' stuff. Let's get moon magic up relatively high. And then uh, dry it up to level two as well. I think that'll be good. And then uh, we'll go shopping. And then we'll go to the end of the game. Nice. Oh right, this takes so long because we don't have our weapons out. I forgot about that. I forgot that was a thing. I need to go. I need to talk to this dude and go do this somewhere else. <laughs> oh, I forgot. I forgot about that little deal. That um, your magic levels up twice as quickly if you're in an area that has your weapons where you have your weapons out. And that is the thing that I did not know growing up. That is the thing that I've learned recently, and I have uh, clearly forgotten.
All right. What am I doing? That's exactly what I wanted. Now, the, the real thing is, like, could I have done this on the way, like, through the Mana Fortress? Probably, but I'm doing this now. I probably could have leveled this stuff up on the way through the Mana Fortress, because we'll probably level up a couple of times on the way through. Uh, I wasn't thinking. Oh, wall is only four magic now. It used to be six. Cool. All right, well, now that's all level two. Okay. All right. Let's heal up. Go to the end of the game now. Yeah, I could have done that on the way through. But I wasn't thinking about that. Okay. Here we go. With with our three magic and our six seeds. <laughs> Let's fucking get it. It's going to take so long to get through all this with, uh, without auto run. Excuse me. I love my sleepy sword. You just like slap him once and then push him out of the way. <laughs> shh, 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 shh. It's nap time now. Now is not the time to fight. Do, 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 do. Boss number one, let's go. crit <laughs> with the uh, lowered defense just rinsed him oh my apologies to men block for taking out his boy so unceremoniously oh my god <laughs> well okay i guess we can level shade up now <laughs> this is, i'm glad i didn't stick around for that I was like, well, we either need both characters and Dryad and a high, pretty high-level sword and Luna Magic, or we just need Shade. And, uh, <laughs> I'm glad I went the busy route, because it was possible. <laughs> now, that being said, that means that Shade was available to us from the get-go. We just had to come in and beat him up and then dip. <laughs> That's hilarious. So a more insane person would have come here, beat the first boss, gotten shade, left, because you start off with the sprite as well. Um,
<laughs> so this is a this could have been a very silly seed if you had come here, beaten up uh, that boss. Oh no! Come on, it was like one frame away from dealing damage. Come here, beat up that boss, get shade, leave, go pick up a few seeds, and then uh, <laughs> go nuke the mana beast, I guess. <laughs> Hilarious. I guess it's you know it's in logic as long as long as you have a whip and a, and a cutting weapon. That first boss is in logic. Let's well, start off with the whip, and then I think the sprite started with gloves, and we found the sword pretty early. So like that first boss <laughs> was in logic pretty early on. Boom! Got him. Oh, we do have to. I do have to think about leveling them up so that they have. Okay, they have full magic. Awesome. I think they just leveled up. I just thought about that. I was like, ooh, make sure. Ooh, did I buy? I didn't buy fairy walnuts. I have one. We'll be fine. Shut up. We'll be fine. <laughs> I didn't buy fairy walnuts. I sat there with like 13,000 gold and I was like, I guess I have everything I need. <laughs> uh, here's hoping. Okay. It's a damn shame we buffed the shit out of the boy. But the uh, other characters can take care of it. No problem. We also don't have the midge mallet or the... Uh, Um, Moogle Belt. So we're going to have to re rely on uh, magic to dam damage cancel. I may have rushed here a little soon. I should have I should have bought Fairy Walnuts. This, this should have been an easy seed. I may have completely fucked myself by not getting... Buying Fairy Walnuts before I came here. <laughs> we'll have to wait and see. Have I made a huge mistake? Let's find out. <laughs> I'm actually like more nervous about this than the uh, mystery seed or the uh, weekly seed that we did earlier. Truth be told.
Just because, I mean, I've only got the one Fairy Walnut, but I've got plenty of... The Sprite's not going to be using any mana whatsoever. So I really just need to keep the girl... Juiced up. There we go. <laughs> what? Why did I panic at all? <laughs> One cycle. We're good. <laughs> okay. Yeah, having a level 6 sword crit and... um. Oops, I accidentally hit it too early. Whatever. Who cares? It's not a race. Uh, You can add an extra 4 seconds to that if you want to. Um, hey! Another seed! That one was really goofy. So it's hilarious that Shade Magic, which I was like, hey, that's a possibility. We could get Shade Magic. We're, we've got like four seeds and zero actual like elements. We could find Shade Magic and uh, nuke the Mana Beast that way. That would be a good way for me to like learn how to do that since I was talking about that at the weekly seed, uh, not knowing how to do that. Um, Shade Magic was on uh, the first boss, was on uh, Buffy or whatever you want to call it. It was on the first boss in... Um, the Mana Fortress, which we had access to pretty early on because we got we started with the whip and then we found the sword. So we had access to that killing that boss and then like leaving, leveling up uh, Shade and then coming back. So this probably could have been done a lot faster. But uh, getting the hint of the girl is in the early game and Dryad is at Empire, I was like, well, that's the route to go since I already have. I started off with the boy and the sprite and then I found the sword just going through like my basic, like my normal checks at the beginning of the game. I was like, that seems like the way to go. Since I have the hints, I didn't know where Shade was. I knew the area where... Now, the, what, what could have sucked is if the girl had been at um, the Earth Temple. If the, <laughs> if I Because I didn't find Gnome. I would have had to hunt down Gnome in order to unlock the Earth Temple and beat Fire Gigas boss in order to get the girl. That could have been really bad. Um, another thing is if like the girl had been at the Water Temple and then it was like, ooh, but you need the Water Seed... Like, uh, and I didn't know that, you know, I, I, I never found out one way or the other if it was, uh, um, uh, restrictive logic or not. That was a fun, that was a fun little, little, uh, mystery seed to do. So it was, um, vanilla short, slight, slightly easy, level up on bosses, triple gold, triple experience, start with the boy and the sprite find the girl at level one <laughs> um and then what are the, some of the other hints i needed three elements in order to get through the mana palace which i did not need sylphid or undine but i did need lumina <laughs> so that was like but that was, that's like a thing you don't need to do ever if it's uh um vanilla short like it opens up it opens up one boss. If you go through that entire thing and then go hit the button at the bottom level, it opens up a single boss. Um, but yeah, I probably would have felt better having the Midge Mallet or the Moogle Belt, knowing that they were in mid-game and late-game respectively, but I didn't need to hunt them down. So what checks did we not do? We didn't do Pure Lands at all. We cleared um, uh, Ice Country. We cleared Empire as well as uh, South Town. I got the first chest out of Gold Tower and then left, so I didn't do any more Gold Tower. I did everything in Fire Palace except fight the boss. I didn't do Matango Cave. Um, I didn't go back to Moon Palace. Moon Palace was blocked by Shade, so fuck it. Uh, that's probably what that was. Is um, I had something. No, that must have been the Gold Key. There was something was in a strange place. Um... Didn't do Lofty Mountains. Didn't do Sprite Village. I didn't beat Springbeak. And that's normally like a thing that I go for because it's a good place to go and like level up spells. Um, no Earth Palace. Didn't do anything. I fought one boss inside of uh, the Sunken Continent. I did the first boss at um, in the uh, Underground Palace. But I didn't do anything at the, the Tree Palace itself. I didn't do the Grand Palace. I picked up both of those chests though. So I skipped a good bit. Yeah, not doing... The, that's the thing, is Pure Lands with boss level up, even if it's slightly easy with them only leveling up one level per kill, it's still like... 
can be a scary thing. So I didn't do anything in the Pure Lands. I didn't do Gold Tower. And those are like the two kind of big checks. And didn't do anything in the Sunken Continent. Really. So yeah. I think that was pretty efficient. I mean, I knew what I was looking for. Once I found, once I found the hints for the girl and Triad, and then I wound up getting Luna Magic, I was like, and I had the sword and the, the sprite and the boy. I was like, all right, well, I guess I know what we're doing is we're getting the girl, we're getting Dryad, we're buffing the shit out of the sword, we're casting Mana Magic and Moon Magic, Moon Energy on the boy, and just swinging for the fences. That was fun. That was a nice little change of pace from the the from the, uh, the the weekly seed, which was very different. Um, cool, good times. This is gonna be it for me today. I started a little earlier because I didn't know how long the weekly seed was going to take me. I'd heard a couple of people really struggled through it. Um, and I have something to do at two. So in the next 35 minutes. <laughs> so but this was fun. I got through it early enough to... What is this? Uh, what is this face? This bot? Me6. I don't know what this is. So we have two we have, we have two bots in the Discord now that are just cluttering things up. Awesome. Yeah, I don't know what bot they're working on. If they if they have an easier way to take care of this, then go for it. So <laughs> and I don't have to keep up a spreadsheet and just like show up. I've, I'm so far behind on messages in the Discord. I don't know what's going on. So I'm going to have to read through all of that stuff. Yay! All right. That is going to be it for me today. Thank you all so much for tuning in. I have my niece's birthday party to go to, and then laundry to do, and then battening down the hatches here and hoping that the hurricane is not going to be too bad. We're pretty far inland. We're I think we're going to get a hurt like a category 1 by the time it makes landfall and gets to central Mississippi. It's probably still going to be a, a category 1, but we need to go like tie down some deck chairs and you know, things like that. We're we've got bottled water, we've got trail mix. We're good to go. <laughs> we'll 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 survive for a week if things go really bad. But I I, I don't think things are going to be too terrible for us. But you never know. Maybe it'll be awful. But I hope not. Okay, I'm going to log off. Thank you all so much for tuning in. I may see you all tomorrow. Maybe not. Depends on the weather. Take care, and bye-bye.